about being overweight. I'm not overweight. Really? The collection is that good. Boring. Well, you're using the battery power of Force G2 to turn anytime. I don't care about yard work. I just changed the channel. There's never anything on TV. Why is TV so boring? Oh my gosh! What's going on? What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Welcome to Greece's Ancient News, news that's so ancient it's hardly even relevant. Today's top story is breaking news from Italy. Mount Vesuvius continues to spew ash and lava. The plume of ash and smoke has grown significantly in size and may affect us if the wind shifts in our direction. We'll keep you posted as more information becomes available. Local news, the Dillian League, comprised of the very powerful city-state of Athens, may be in trouble in the Peloponnesian War. For more on this, we turn to Paige Allman. Gilbert. Sparta has a great advantage over Athens because of geography. Because Sparta is located inland, this makes it impossible for them to be attacked by sea. Secondly, the only thing that Sparta has to do to attack Athens is march north. This spells trouble for the Athenians. If they want their reputation as a powerful city-state to stay intact, they must win this war. If they do not, it may never be as powerful as it is now. There are also rumors that Sparta may team up with Persia in order to capture Athens. Things are not looking good for the Athenians. Back to you, Gilbert. From this fighting, we are beginning to see a very powerful ruler rise. His name is Alexander, and he is the son of King Philip. He has won many battles throughout Asia Minor. He has recently conquered the Persian Empire and is beginning to cross the Hindu Kush into India. We'll keep you posted on his whereabouts. Yeah. In sports news, we had the results of the Olympics that recently occurred. Let's go for Adrian for more information. Good morning everyone, I'm here with the results of the Olympics. Aurelius Epirus has won the gold medal in junior boxing. Kyanis of Sparta has set another jump record, this time in the triple jump. Lastly, Siniska of Sparta has been, become the first woman to ever win an event at the Olympics. The athletes competed naked, just as they have in previous years, as the Olympics are a celebration of the body. Otherwise, I have plenty of pictures to show you. That's all for me, back to you Gilbert. Thanks Adrian, well it looks like we're out of time. For all of us here at Ancient News, have a great day! Today, mostly sunny with a high of 76 degrees, turning breezy in the afternoon. Tonight, cloudy with a chance of a passing shower, low 55 degrees. Tomorrow, cloudy, turning cooler with a high of 68 degrees, winds 15 to 25 miles per hour. Air quality. Athens, good. Sparta, fair. Pollen levels. Athens, high. Sparta, medium. Ugh, boring. Ugh, change the channel. What was that? In local news, the delay. 
In the sports do. news, we had the results. And of you can the... you can separate that. So like, if we can do it in two different ones, what are you doing? <laughs> I know King Philip. He has won many battles throughout minor Asia. <laughs> Sparta. He's just set another record. This time in the triple jump. Last knee. Last knee. Miss Gilbert, come on. Don't kick me. I'm the first woman to ever win this. <laughs> He's like <laughs> licking the cherry. That would be great. <laughs> I just saw Gilbert's on his and I'm like, wait a minute.